hey 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 welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing to you the purple cake so i must say this is made with natural ingredients and no artificial food colors without wasting time let's just get started i've got here about six medium sized eggs so i'll get a bowl and come in with the yolks i will drop in a little bit of vanilla essence I've got here about 200 grams of butter. I'll just melt it up in a microwave. I'll drop the melted butter into the eggs. With the help of my spoon, I'll mix it up. But as you can see, it's all mixed up and fluffy now. I'll come in with about three tablespoonful of full cream milk and mix it up again. I will drop in about half a teaspoon of cinnamon powder. I will drop in my cake flour a little bit at a time. I'll be using 200 grams of cake flour. I will come in with 15 grams of baking powder. When I'm done mixing, I'll set it aside for later. Now I'll get my egg white and I'll whip it up. As I'm whipping, I'll come in with my sugar. I'll be using 150 grams of sugar. So as you can see, it's very fluffy and stiff now. I'll set it aside for later. Now I'll get my flour mixture and come in with about one tablespoonful of cocoa powder. Now I've got here beetroot powder. I'll drop it into the mixture and keep on mixing. And as you know, it's very red. This has no artificial additives. It's just beetroot that has been made into the powdered form. As you can see, we've got a purple color over here. Now I'll come in with my whipped egg white. I'll do it a little bit at a time. After mixing everything, this is what we have here. I'll get my baking pan and transfer the mixture into it. I'll bake this in a preheated oven of about 150 degrees Celsius. I'll bake it for about 30 minutes. So it is ready, I'll just get it out of the pan. And yes guys, this is so soft. and it looks perfect inside. The combination of cocoa powder and beetroot powder is just out of the world. And look at how soft this is. It looks and feels like a cushion. You definitely need this on your breakfast table. I hope you did enjoy this and I hope you are going to give this a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. You can send me pictures if you want to. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye!